All right, I'm here with a Wendy Hirsch at the Roosevelt Island Disability Fair, and it's Wednesday, July 21st. So Wendy, can you tell us a little bit about, about the Disability Fair, please? Oh, sure, Rick. So during the pandemic, um, a lot of people's disabilities came more to the surface, but even before that, we have um, a large population of people with disabilities living here and very few resources. So we've been wanting to do this for a while. We wanted to do it after Hope Memorial. I guess, thank God we didn't because it poured. Um, we did it today, and thank God it poured before this started. Um, we have from all different agencies that service people with disabilities. So we have mental health, we have substance abuse, we have hearing loss, um, visually impaired, we have case management, um, we have Access VR, which is actually where I work, which helps uh, students up to whatever age, adults, who want to go back to work, we help them get tra uh, training and work. Uh, YAI, which uh, deals with people with de developmental disabilities. Uh, the politicians are here. Uh, Senator Serrano's office, uh, Halos' office is here. The Fortune Society is here, who has an array of services for people with disabilities or without disabilities who have criminal justice involvement. Uh, we have an agency that deals with uh, Alzheimer's. Um, and we actually have two visions visually impaired uh, agencies here. So it's, we have the child school who is actually here on Roosevelt Island and actually uh, refers people to access VR. So it's, it's a good combination of people. Uh, we were looking for more. Some people because of the range income, some people because of the pandemic, they're not going back into the office yet. So hopefully we will do this again. Uh, it will be more open to everybody. We will get the word out quicker and more, I guess, holy to the whole island. Um, but we will be doing it again. Okay. And the feedback we got back is great because people are coming back who had mothers, maybe, who they're thinking of moving here and don't know anything about their disability. So they could actually come down and thank us. For this. Mm -hmm. And um, if a person who wasn't here today wants to contact some of these uh, departments. Is there a way of doing they can that? Contact me. Actually, I'm going to take some of the literature back with us to the reader office. And if they need some literature and they weren't able to come today, I can provide that with them. Right, great. Thank you very much. Thank you, Rick.